Hello, Your Honor. Welcome down to Thursday. Thanks for logging in. Well, sunny and fertile. That's my prediction today for the Librans. And yes, I mean fertile in every way, shape, and form. So be careful, if you know what I mean. The moon starts in Libra, your sign. So I think you wake up feeling sunny and cool. Everything's just going great. And as the moon moves into Scorpio, it's going to shift your emotional focus now to your soul capital. That is your self-esteem, how you feel or don't feel about yourself. And that is, of course, how productive you are. If you feel very good about yourself, well, you can go out and do big things. If you don't feel good about yourself, well, then you can't be productive or it's hard to. You can't make, wave your magic wand. Now, there may be a bit of a mm, face-off as the moon first moves into Scorpio. If we're unclear about certain emotional boundaries, I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know how I feel about that. Moon moves into Scorpio, I know how I feel. So there is definitely going to be that shift there. So things will focus for you emotionally. But just go with what you know at that point. So we're on the sun. Another reason I say fertile is today Venus is ruling the day. We're in chapter two of Sun and Aquarius. And you, my friend, are working on your heart chakra and your personal dreams. What are you spiritually supposed to do on this planet? Well, I got a little secret for you. It's what you love, okay? And today with Venus ruling the day, love is predominant on the earth. This is an excellent day to start creating. Now, what you ideally want to do is get on the path of what you love, right? That's career. That's romance, that's children, that's friendships. Everywhere you want, to, you want to be on the path of what you love. So today's a great day to lay the foundation for what that path is. That's what Venus is about. It's about creation. So let's start to create that path. Don't worry, it's just a, it's just a beta version. Chapter 3 is where you really start to manifest it. And also, if you're still harboring any resentments of times when your kid couldn't come out to play, well, why don't we start to heal that now? It's okay, because you know what? Mama or Dada, which is you, is going to make it all right. Also, we got a new episode of Sadiqa Salter's Renegade Aromatherapist today. She's going to be helping you with plant essences and helping you step into that inner child. So watch Sadiqa. She'll literally give you something you can smell, a plant that will be your friend, and in your case, will open up your heart chakra. All right, that's all I have for the day, Libra. I will see you tomorrow with your weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So God.